2017 was a landmark year for women. From the Women's March to the hashtag MeToo movement, inequality was increasingly being exposed. Despite this progress, 10 out of 10 top stream tracks on Spotify were from men artists. While people began waking up to gender disparity in music, clearly our listening habits don't reflect the change we want to see. This is the story of how Smirnoff, an activist brand in music, and Spotify, the world's largest music platform, came together to transform people's listening habits at scale by increasing the number of women artists they listen to. So ahead of International Women's Day, Smirnoff partnered with Spotify to launch the Smirnoff Equalizer. Users connected the Equalizer to their Spotify accounts to see just how equal or unequal their listening habits were between men and women artists. The Equalizer gave users the opportunity to try a more equalized playlist based on their listening habits. Users could use a slider to add in even more women artists and could share their new playlists via social. The Equalizer debuted at our New York City launch event, revealing the partnership between the Smirnoff Equalizer and Honey Dijon. From there, the campaign was launched in the US, UK, Ireland, Australia, Mexico, and Argentina. And as people started to share the results, the world started to notice, and a conversation was started. And even those that thought their listening habits were equal were sometimes shocked to find out the truth. Fans started calling out their favorite up-and-coming women artists. All of this led to more discovery, more exposure, and more opportunity for great women artists on the worldwide stage, all part of Smirnoff's broader goal of equalizing music and doubling the number of women headliners at festivals. This year, we've moved one step closer to achieving gender parity in music and will continue to empower change.